All right, we continue in right along on this 21 pilots train with another live request. Roll it. Welcome back to the channel, everybody. Channel's name is The Third Ernest. I'm Ernest Adiano The Third, y'all guys third family. If you're new here and you're not subscribed and you like what you see at the end of the video, consider clicking the subscribe button bottom right hand corner. Now we didn't got Tyler Joseph Drown. We got Addict With A Pen, live UG sessions, another highly requested track. And then this live performance is also highly requested. And this is, damn, I already forgot what this is. This is a uh, Fall Away Live featuring, I don't know if it's Blum, Dr. Blum or Dr. Bloom, but this request is a Patreon request and that Patreon subscriber is Jared Champ. Jared, I appreciate your subscription over there, man. I appreciate your patience for me to get to your track, but we are here finally. If anybody out there wants to potentially support the channel in other ways, if you have the monetary capability to do so, and you feel like you get enough entertainment out of the channel and want to see us grow and prosper, check out the Patreon first link down in the description. Now, ever since I did the live version on Jimmy Fallon of Level of Concern, and we had this guy playing the trumpet in the background, people were like, yo, you need to do this one. So I'm finally glad that somebody was able, somebody was able to push to the forefront with their Patreon subscription. But that's it, that's all that I gotta say. I'm always excited to do 21 Pilots live videos because from what everything that I've seen, they are amazing performers live. And from what I've seen of this trumpet player here, he can blow the hell out of that thing. So follow your boy on Instagram and on Twitter, at the third earnest, just like the channel, links are down in the description below. And we got Fall Away Live. Let's get it. Blow that shit, dog. You know what I'm saying? Damn. Okay. I see what y'all, I see what the hype is. Yo, playing a trumpet is so hard to do. Like, to be able to, like, you only have these three things right here. I mean, there's a couple of different things within the trumpet, but you literally make different notes with the way that you, with the way that you move your, move your lips. Shit is wild to me, son. And I don't know if you know how tiring, like, this motion right here. Like this from a from a clarinet player, like I can't even do it. I can't, I used to be able to do it for the trumpet, but yo, like a whole nother level of respect for people who can play the trumpet legitimately. Ooh, mm, it's higher. Bring down that tempo, bring down that volume. I have to point out before we get any further, I have not heard the studio version of this track yet. I probably should have listened to it before recording this now that I think about it, but I also wanted to save it for a video in case I want to do like a 21 Pilots marathon all of a sudden. So I said this on the last video that I wasn't going to pick apart the lyrics, but right here, I'm not going to pick apart the lyrics unless something like truly easily stands out to me, which is like 50-50 chance with Tyler because the dude can be cryptic just as much as Joji can be cryptic. Bro, he's going ham on that trumpet, son. And I like the vibe of this track, or at least the live version. Again, I haven't heard the studio version. Kind of got more of like a hip hop bounce to it more than more than a rock bounce to it. And this was uploaded in 2014, so I don't know how big they were at this time because the stage looks pretty small and I now and know and I know the stage the stages that they grace now a little bit larger than this, but it's dope like an intimate atmosphere, an intimate setting. <laughs> Bro. Bro, his flow, his delivery is so money. And also the ability to like, to, he didn't, I don't think he took a single breath right there. So just the vocal control and the lung capacity to be able to like belt all that or like to, to rap all that basically all in one take. Josh's physique, like it's like muscular, but it's, it's, it's skinny. I wish I had the self-discipline to eat right and go to the gym because that like that frame is my natural physique, I would say, but tacos just be so good. Mexican food is just so good. Sometimes you gotta make great sacrifices, you know? I'm so very Ooh. 
Yo, like their production quality of their live music videos has gotten so much better since they've since they obviously make more money now. They can hire bigger budget production and and, and just this, it sounds cleaner. Like right here, it sounds like we're hearing we're hearing the live music. It's like we're hearing it through the microphone on these cameras versus like they're, they're like they got the sound being recorded directly from like the from the soundboard. And I saw that piano that I from from what people tell me or from what I've from what I've gathered over the last year listening to Twenty One Pilots is that that piano goes everywhere that they go. And I think just like those little things are dope. Hey, 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 okay, okay. You good back there? I just realized, and it's a good thing I'm doing these in the, or in the random order that I'm doing them, but I but I listened to the song Drown by Tyler Joseph originally. That was the first one out of this little like four or five track marathon that we're going on. But I'm glad that I listened to that because these lyrics are directly pulled from that song. And I was wondering what it was gonna sound like with Josh's drumming on top of that song that Tyler wrote by himself. And so I'm glad that I get to hear that on top of Josh's drumming, because that's what I was wondering originally. And it sounds dope. It sounds exactly like what I thought it would sound like once you put Josh on the track. Every time Oh, and by the way, I know that I know that he didn't really do any drumming right there while he was rapping because he obviously wants the raps and the delivery to stand out. Uh, but like in the in the overall arrangement of the track, it sounds better than it did just by itself in the song Drown. Now I know it's Dr. Bloom because he just said it. And it also looks like it's a pretty small of like venue, like I was saying earlier. It looks like I could see the walls in the background whenever we pan this way. I was trying to look at like what was past event staff. Like crazy how big they they how big they got. And all it took was one song. It took one song to put them in front of everybody's eyes. And then they had to deliver when they had the world's like attention captured and they did deliver. It's crazy. <laughs> See, like right there when he was doing that, he was playing like these different notes, like moving it up and down just with his mouth. Cause obviously you can only do so much with just like the, I don't even know what it's called, a plunger with a valve. I think it's a valve if I'm not mistaken. Shit, now I gotta look it up. Cause I don't wanna look like a dumbass. Trumpet anatomy? Is that what you would call it? First, second, third valve, second valve side. Yo, shh, nah. I knew that those two years abandoned middle school would come in handy. This actually looks like the same the same venue that they shot the music video for uh, Car Radio. I don't know, I, I, is that the same? Am I getting that same vibe? Is that accurate? Yeah, that was dope. I definitely have to go back and listen to the actual track so that way I can hear like what the actual lyrics were because it was very hard to hear the lyrics right there. I obviously did make out that some of the lyrics came from the song Drown by Tyler Joseph solo like by himself. So that was dope that he took those lyrics and then they fit within the overall theme of the song.
But yo, that was dope. Dr. Bloom, like he killed that. Obviously I was expecting him to because like you don't get to that level of music playing the trumpet unless you are a legitimate trumpet player, you know? But yo, that brings us to the end of this video. Ladies and gentlemen, if you like what you see, please consider liking the video, leaving a comment down below, helps the algorithm. If you like what you see enough in these long form breakdowns and wanna catch future videos like this, hit the subscribe button and the notification bell bottom right hand corner. Jared, once again, man, I really appreciate this request and your Patreon subscription. One, the request was something that had been highly requested, but I couldn't ever get to whenever I had a normal job. So the Patreon request and the fact that you're a Patreon subscriber is what allowed me to get to it much sooner. Anybody else wants to potentially become a Patreon, if you have that monetary capability and you feel like you get something out of the channel that you wanna put, that you wanna say you directly help monetarily, help see the channel where it can go and help keep us on YouTube. If you're not in a monetary position, that is also completely all right. I know not everybody is gonna be able to go ahead and go toward the Patreon. So y'all just being here watching these videos, especially where we're at in this video, if you're still listening, then that, that means everything. Follow your boy on Instagram, Twitter and on discord all linked down in the description below you want to check out my daily life and the stupid things that I tweet about follow those if you want to talk to me and other like-minded people the discord is the best place to do it and I am constantly in the discord but that's all that I got for today ladies and gentlemen I appreciate your time and like I always say at the end of all of my videos go out there in the world love and care for one another love and care for each other and I'll catch everybody on the next video peace